Here we go. The following match is scheduled for one fall and it is for the NCW United States Championship. Either way, here comes the only man to hold the United States title four times. The only man to hold the Champion of Champions title more than once. This will be looking to make himself the top star here in NCW. And he's looking to become a five-time, 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 five-time United States Champion here in NCW. But he's looking to challenge the longest reigning United States Champion at five weeks so far. That being Andrew Ramirez. But either way, the challenger look, not to mention, this will be if he wins his match, he'll become the first man to win seven titles. As Angel Romero is coming out with the gold on his own this time. He knows this could be the biggest challenge to date and he's faced off against Tyson Steele. Uh, Antonio Blackwell amongst others but does he have what it takes to retain against a man who has reached the top of the mountain not once but twice a man who has held that gold four times in his career Andrew Romero says, claims that he is the king of America, or at least that he is the guardian of the United States title, that it belongs to the Redemption Kingdom. Does he have what it takes to keep his promise and continue to be the longest reigning United States champion in all of NCW? And that's what it's all about, that United States Championship. The belt that so many has held. But it's not who wins the gold, it's who wins it the... M who can hold it the longest, or who can win it the most. One reign won't solidify you as a superstar. Dizzle B knows this, he's already up at four. But Angel Ramirez, he hasn't been a one and done champion, no, he's held that title for five weeks. He's defended against Buddy Andrews, A Antonio Blackwell, Tyson Steele, and um, Jesse Rose as well. So there's been no shortage of challenges of top tier level heading in his direction but here we go Dizzle B versus Angel Ramirez this is a mu this is a main event quality match this is a pay-per-view quality match we're giving it away for free but Dizzle B with his first move of the night slamming Andrew Ramirez into the ground before getting encountered with that arm drag. Here we go, off the ropes. Looking for a DDT early. 
as he nails Dizzleby's face into the mat. And here we go with the curve stomp once again nailing him into the mat. But this will be with the arm drag of his own counter. Here we go, Irish whip off the ropes. Goes for a running knee looking like it was heading for the midsection or the face. But Angel Merritt's able to stop it. Look at those heavy hook, heavy right hand to the face. Followed up with a German suplex. And a double stomp to the gut. Pull it up with a kick to the chest and a stomp. But Andrew Romero is grabbing the arm, able to flick him off as Dizzleby gets back to his feet. And look at that spinning reverse STO. But Dizzleby back to his feet, able to throw him out. Here we go, spear to the midsection. Sunset flip powerbomb. But here we go, look at these heavy hooks to the face. As we're up to a three count, we saw a count out in our last match. We could see another one here right now. And Angel Ramirez drops Dizzleby face first into the concrete floor. With his full body weight on it. But look at this, looking to snap the arms. Oh, look at that, just stretching. Irish Whip into the ring, champion follows. Here we go, back, back splash. Here we go, throws him off. Irish Whip over the top rope. Shot to the midsection, here we go, this will be set up. Oh, into the DDT, Hangman's DDT. Takes the bow, points to the ref to count two, but this will be able to kick out. Look at this, this will be a beautiful counter there. Oh, counters that knee shot attempt and then nails the sling blade. Kick to the gut. Now it's Angel Ramirez, the one who's bowing as he gets nailed in the back of the head with that scissor kick. Ooh, kick out, but Angel Ramirez not giving up the title that easy. But here we go. Dizzle B looking to end it all, shot to the face. Big skull crushing finale, or whatever I called it the other day. One, two, no. Andrew Romero is able to kick out. Able to hang on to this match. Oh, big elbow drop, but missing. Oh, and nails him with the cutter. Here we go, he's into the pin. But arm under the bottom rope. Andrew Ramirez now dragging Dizzle out to the middle of the ring. Looking for a big swing. And here he goes, around and round. Andrew Ramirez does not stop swinging. But will it be enough to beat Dizzle B? He goes in for the cover. One, two. Not quite enough to pin Dizzle B. I mean, he's been to the top of the mountain twice now. There's Angel Ramirez looking to go top rope. 
This will be in the middle of the ring. Can he go this far? Oh, tries for a diving neck breaker, but just couldn't get his hands around the neck due to the range. But this will be with the leg trip. Oh, feints him with a forearm and then nails him with a leg scissors. Or the freaking um, scissor kick. Oh, look at that double barrel salute. And Romero is not ready to give up just yet. The Irish whips him off the rope, no counter. Over the top. There's a B now trying to take him out, but no. Big running elbow strike from Angel Ramirez to the chest, to the heart of Dizzle B. Look at that. Just squatting while tied up while tying up his legs. But Dizzle able to kick him off. Boom. As Dizzle B has claimed this is it. This is where he becomes a five-time United States champion as he drills the champ into the mat, splitting him wide open. Before rolling him over for the cover. Is that it? Do we have a new champion? One, two, three. And you've seen it here on episode 70. Dizzle B has won his fifth United States Championship where he can finally say that he is a five time, five time, five time, five time, five time United States Champion and added to the fact that he is a two time champion of champions that means he is a seven time champion, the first have ever in NCW history Alexander Leonardo Davis and Lucha Rainbow they're only at six along with Tony Lee Williams but Dizzle B was the man who raised up to the top to win his seventh. As he goes in for the cover. One, two, three. No, forget. But these two put on a hell of a match. But this is where it all came to an end. <coughs> With the Diz crushing finale. One, two, three. Look at that. After 70 long episodes, he can claim it for his fifth time. The gold is back where it belongs for Dizzle B.